you're gonna see this blue like circle as you can see right there and what you'll do is you'll hover this over to your new phone right on top align it hello guys today we're gonna to be setting up this 13 mini it is the last mini series Apple came out with and we're gonna give you a quick tutorial on how to set it up let's begin So the color of choice that we have here is Midnight. And I'll show you a comparison of what is the size difference compared to the original 13 series. And so side by side, I'm gonna have here, as you can see, a 13 series and a 13 mini. And just to give you a better look, we're just gonna have them standing up. All right, let's get started. Now when setting up this phone, if you switch to a new carrier or starting up a new carrier, you wanna make sure you enter the SIM card first before turning it on. So as you can see here, you'll see this uh, hole right there and you'll use the SIM card key that comes with it. And you'll find that in this box. This right here. So this SIM pin will be used. If you have the SIM card already, you will pop this open. And you'll place the SIM card right in here. Now some carriers also activate an eSIM. That's going to be a uh, next video. But let's get started. So the first thing that comes up is selecting your language. We're going to go ahead with English and country, United States. Now this is my favorite part. If you have an existing iPhone, we could transfer everything directly from the old iPhone to this new one, and I'll show you. I have the 13 right here, and then you'll see it detected the phone. All right, so when you're in this page, your, your new phone and your old phone will detect each other. As you continue here, you're gonna see this blue-like circle, as you can see right there. And what you'll do is you'll hover this over to your new phone, right on top, align it, and then it's gonna have you to continue. So once your phone has finished transferring data or still in the process, it's gonna ask you if you wanna use Face ID. In this case, we're gonna set this up later, but if you select continue, you're gonna have to move your um, face around um, so it could capture your entire face for face ID. But as of now, we're going to set this up later. And here you could create a password. This will be your backup password for in case the face ID does not work. And you have two options. You could use a six digit code or you could go right here and select four digit number code instead. Well, we're going to keep it at four for now. Well, for now, we're just going to bypass that. And we'll set that up later. And then here again, in case you, you didn't have an iPhone and you had a Samsung, Google, or an Android phone, you have the option to move your data from Android. And from there, you're gonna have to download an app called Move to iOS. But for now, this is a brand new phone. We're just gonna set it up new. And one thing with Apple is you need a Apple ID. If you don't have one, you can simply uh, select forgot password and you could create a free Apple ID. And you can use, you put your information 
you could use your email as your username and create your password. Now the whole purpose of an Apple ID is so you could download apps and transfer data. But for now, we're gonna set this up later. All right, and of course you have to agree to the terms and conditions. And this is just saying it's gonna keep your phone up to date. We'll continue. You wanna use iMessage and FaceTime. That's one of the key benefits to using a 13 mini. Locations, you have the options to disable or uh, keep. You have the options to disable or keep on. Uh, this is good if you mostly use maps. And Siri. Siri now comes with uh, different voices. And let me show you a few. We're gonna keep volume up. Oh, this is also the key uh, buttons right here. You have up and down for volume control. And you have uh, this to silence your phone. Anytime you see that red, that means you're in silence mode. Silence mode off, silence mode on. Well, let's keep that on for now. This right here is for power. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in settings. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in settings. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in settings. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in settings. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in settings. All right, so those are your Siri voice options. And for now, we're just gonna set this up later. And when you go to this page right here, you'll see the appearance of the screen background. This is the light appearance, and this was the dark. Now, the best part about the dark is that it's, of course, battery saving. As we continue, you can change the display of your phone zoom or standard welcome to iphone and that's it for our tutorial today for this iphone mini i know it's not much details but this is a pretty nice phone we're going to be testing it out uh, for the coming days and give you more details about it but overall what i like compared to the iphone se is that it uses up the entire screen versus the se kind of stops uh, midway all right, guys, that's it for our 13 mini uh, review. I hope you liked it. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you want more content and fun. Till next time. Peace. <laughs>